For John Young, well known in the region as the longtime leader and songwriter for the popular indie band Straight to VHS, his lifelong ambition was to make it as a rock musician. When COVID curtailed those hopes, his past succession of day jobs, working in restaurant kitchens, led him to a hobby that unexpectedly blossomed into a new business. I've been working in kitchens since I was like 12 years old. Really never liked it, <laughs> right? I was good at it, fast, but working in restaurants is very difficult and high stress. But when I started to learn how to make bagels and bake, that I enjoy. In June 2021, John and his wife Hannah started crafting baked goods and confections in the tiny kitchen of their home in Ledyard, stocking a decorated shelving unit next to their driveway. You know how like you're like in a neighborhood you go and there's like leave a book, grab a book thing. I was kind of thinking about that, like kind of like people go for like walks in the morning and they like have this like this little cute stand with like bagels on it and stuff like that. The experiment was originally a weekends only side gig. Customers paid what they wanted or could afford, and the makeshift stand stayed open mornings until the shelves were empty. We just did it, and it like worked, right? Like it was like six bagels the first time I did it. So I thought it was fun, like a fun little niche thing. And what became a sort of reverse peeping Tom exercise on their own property, John and Hannah would peek through their living room curtains and watch as more and more people came to avail themselves of the baked goodness. It was really exciting and it was really fun to watch people. <laughs> Cause I mean, I think we both thought like we aren't bakers. Like why are people gonna come drive to our driveway to come get stuff? Once we started selling out like that and then people kept talking to me about it or I heard people talking about it that didn't realize that I was the person that was doing it. That's when I started to be like, okay, these people are driving from like miles away to come to my house <laughs> like in the morning must be if I opened a shop I'm sure like the same thing would happen. They found a spot in Stonington's Velvet Mill, a consortium hosting small businesses, artisans and restaurants. Careful scrutiny on the internet turned up quality secondhand equipment and with the enthusiastic help of friends the space was transformed and the flower shop hosted a grand opening in October 2022. While John still has his job as manager of a pizza restaurant, he's on site at the flower shop before dawn and late into the night. I ro like romanticize it. It's like the French bakers, they like come in early in the morning before anybody else is around. The people show up and it's like, they don't even realize the hard work that went into it. Before, they, while they were sleeping in their beds, you like did all this work and then they show up and it's like warm, just made. If at first John regarded baking as a tangential means of support for his music, he came to realize that his art is something that can flourish in more than one way. COVID and now this have put music on the back burner. I think that left a kind of hole because he is such a creative person. And I think this has kind of snuck its way into that hole as a fulfilling thing, a way to create things like music. I don't think it will ever replace music for him, but I definitely think it's a good placeholder. To complete the artistic metaphor, John and Hannah, with their two small children often at their sides, have, in the flower shop, created their own family band. Or maybe a concept album called In the Key of Bagel. I mean, it's been so busy, thankfully, that it's hard to like have a minute to like kind of step back and realize, like, oh my God, this is how far this has come. But when those minutes come, it's like, I can't believe we're doing this. It's very gratifying to see that all these people are interested in a thing that was a little shelf in a driveway for so long.